audience. Yeah, any question? So good evening. I am Dr. Anupam Dev. I am from Hockey Hockeyvee is a retrofitment company. So we are retrofitting normal IC cars into electric, pure electric basically, which would come to the public at half the price or maybe less than half the price of a new car, sir. But uh, we would like to request the government for some support, sir. Electric cars have a GST of 5%, the new cars. Whereas our cars are being charged at 18%. So the, we call upon the reduction of uh, uh, the GST taxes on the retrofitment, sir. <laughs> Your demand is, uh, <laughs> is very important. Yes, sir, because uh, see, half of the middle class will, will go for retrofitment. I will take this proposal to the finance minister. Thank you so this much. This is sir. also good because two wheelers, three wheelers, and car. If the poor and middle class people convert them, it can be really a good thing. And we have already uh, passed the all standards related with it, and we will support it. There are a lot of startups who are going Sir, to Sir, we would it. also request the governments to come forward and use, recycle their old vehicles and retrofit sir, it. Sir, it is dependent. Army is doing it, sir. I am doing cars for the first, army. First of all, what my suggestion is, it is depending upon the quality which you are giving. So we are following all yeah, the I, AI I know standards. That. It is to be. It is to be. Market is going to decide about it. Yeah. Yes. You Thanks. Can give Thanks. A good alternative, Thank you. Thank you. Hundred percent people will prefer it, and they will take it. From Thank you, sir. Yes. Thank you. Just I was in Tirupati. There was electric bus, and actually the same principle they have. Actually, it is going to reduce the cost, but the cost of the uh, that value was very high. Somewhere we need to reduce that, and we have to make bus very nicely, beautifully, furniture and everything. Without that, people will not take it. That is to be a problem. Uh, my last question, what really will drive uh, e-mobility? Will it be two-wheelers? Will it be cars? Will it be buses, trucks? What? All e-vehicles. And we don't need to make any market for it. I'm just asking you a simple question. Probably you may have a petrol car. Your expenditure on your car may be 25 to 30,000 rupees per month. If suppose it comes to 3,000, I don't need to market you to tell you that use electric cars. Now the people are understand. Only problem is that as compared with the petrol, car, scooter, auto rickshaw, the electric cost is high. But within due course of time, it will be same like petrol car and there is a lot of saving. At the same time, there is no pollution. So people are going to take it. Now you don't need to add uh, people. Now there are 400 startups. They are making <laughs> electric vehicles, electric scooters. And everyone is booked. They are getting good orders. Some of the people making e-cart. I am telling you the example of e-rickshaw. When I started it and talking about it, there was one crore people who were driving e-rickshaw. I filed the case up to the Supreme Court. And today I am happy. That one crore people, you never see this cycle rickshaw on the road. Totally it is a transformation, it is change. So I feel that the people know, they understand what is the benefit and they will, by natural course, they will take the decision and it is going to be a big market for the country. Thank you so much, Mr. Gadkari. It was a pleasure.